Hey, how's everyone doing? This is part 4 of Muay Thai VCS story. So this is Forza Horizon 5, running on the running on the Thai VCS via uh, Xbox Cloud Gaming, you know? And uh, I'm using the, the Thai VCS joystick with it, you know? And uh, this is my, my favourite car of all time, the uh, Trans Am from Night Rider, you know? And this is just an example, you know, of, of what the VCS can do. Uh, back in back in Christmas twenty twenty twenty, this wasn't possible, you know. So I'll just show you just how far along the the VCS has come, you know. Now it's all streaming, you know, which is great, which means there's no loading, no updating, no downloading. It's all instant, you know, which is awesome, you know, because you know we think it's awesome. Now a lot of people that don't like the type of VCS will say, well, we can do that on on my smartphone. We can do this on my tablet. I don't need the VCS to do that. That's true, but if you, you know, it's awesome that the VCS can do it, and it does it very well. So that's, you know, that's awesome, you know. So then, you know, people bring up uh, the word, um, exclusives, you know. Well, okay, well, I don't know for sure if, if the VCS has, um, exclusive games or not, but, you know, like, the, the, that's not important to me, you know. They like, get... Uh, the fact that we can play retro games, we can play games like this, we can play games through Stadia, you know, we can emulate any game we want, with ease and comfort and style, plus, on the Atari VCS was success, and that's what matters to me, plus the VCS has saved me a ton of money, I don't have to play for an online su subscription, I don't have to do this and that if I don't want to, and that's, and that's another thing that, that, that that's great about the Atari VCS. I mean, we, we can make my own experience, you know. We can use with, with any control I want, we can do it, you know. So, yeah, I mean, this is awesome, we think it is, you know what I mean? You know, so, like, um, so, that's one thing, like, that the haters just can't get their, their, their mind around, you know. Uh, they always bring up, well, I don't need the Atari VCS. Well, you can do it, and right now on the Switch, uh, you, 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 you can't play, you can't. Play Forest of Five or on the or on the um PlayStation. So there you go, League. Like, you know that's for me. That's that's awesome, League. Like, you know, and I uh, love uh, this game and the fact that the 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 VCS can do it, League. Like, you know, so League. Like, you know, um. So I'm I'm gonna go back to the main menu of of, of the Atari VCS. You know, and um, show you a few of the games that are actually in the store, League. Like, you know. Yeah, as far as I know, like, these games are only on the VCS, you know. So, like, I don't know which is an, an, an exclusive or not, like, you know. So, Sydney Hunter, now, Plan Smashers, now, Black Widow Recharge, that's on the Switch as well, like, you know. But all these games are awesome, in my opinion. Centipede Recharge, you know, all awesome, you know. And they keep adding more and more games to, to the VCS, like, you know. And they would like it. You know, it's snappy, it's bright and colourful. You know, it's um, I like it. You know, and um, uh, uh, some stuff. Now, a trust lander. I think that's a, an 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 exclusive. I haven't seen that anywhere else. Like you know, and uh, stadia and uh, tail gunner. I think that's an an, an exclusive as well. But uh, then again, I'm not sure. Like you know. Well, like I said, like, exclusives aren't important to me. The fact that we can play games from the BCS store and that they're adding new games every week. Like, you see the 7800 games every Friday. I tell you, bringing out 7800 games, which is awesome, you know. It's called Flashback Fridays, you know. And now the, the entire BCS has, has a friends list, which wasn't there before. So, you know, it's getting better all the time. More and more games and stuff are getting added to it, which is, which is awesome. So this is it, like um, and you know Spotify, Disney Plus all run great on the VCS, you know. So, like, the 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 gen the story is the the VCS is a, a a reality. It came out, it came out, and it it delivered on 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 its promises, especially to me and to other um loyal hardcore Atari fans. And again, we'll, we'll explain just what that means. I'm, I'm talking about fans like me that 
put their money where their mouth is and say, yes, I'm going to support Atari and I'm going to buy the system. I wasn't like immature or being a, a, an idiot about it. You know, I didn't sell my stuff or burn my Atari sh- short and protest like a fucking idiot. No, I said, I'm, I'm going to support my uh, Atari and we're going to make sure that the VCS comes out and it's awesome and it is. So, not just for me, but everyone out there that, that backed the Atari VCS, 11,000 of us that made it happen, we should all be happy that, uh, it, that it, it, it came out. It's 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 actually gotten better over time with new games and apps, and twenty twenty two is going to be even better. So let's celebrate the 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 fiftieth anniversary of Atari by saying, yes, Atari are back and they're here to stay for for a few uh, for let's say Atari will will be around, uh, fifty more years. It will be dead. Atari will still be going, still going, in some way, shape, and form. And I'm hope I hope. The VCS is still going in some form, which I think has a chance. The fact that it can do Xbox games, Stadia, Crown, we can we can play any game you want, really. The only thing the, the VCS doesn't have is is a Blu-ray player, and it doesn't have who who top tier graphics as an Xbox Series X. So that's it, and the price will come down over time. So that's it. I mean, the, that's the end of my Atari VCS story. Uh, you know, I had a, a rough beginning, but it, it delivered on, on its promises. It's an awesome console PC hybrid, and you can use any controller you want. You can do anything you want. There's no restrictions like a console has, and that's the main selling point. I think. But if you hate it, I mean, I can't change your mind. You know, if you have a, a PC already, then yeah, really, there's no real point in getting the VCS. But if you're a hardcore Atari fan like me, then get it. It's a no-brainer. It's just as simple as that. Or if you have any interest in Atari whatsoever, then yeah, in my, in my opinion, it's it's a good it's a good system, you know. We've had one since 2020. I haven't had any issues with it and it's gotten better over time, you know. So I hope everyone out there has a great day. Uh, take care and bye-bye.